What's up, Gifgaf? I'm Flaxfert. I'm here today to tell you about what I'm up to over the next five days. I'm doing this thing that's um, for charity at the moment, which is to live on a pound a day. It's live below the line. Uh, the links are in the description down below. Um, and it involves, well, basically living on a maximum of a pound, one pound per day for your food and drink. I'm not doing it for charity myself. I've already donated to somebody who else is doing it, but I thought I'd give it a go and then do a, uh, a running video on how I'm getting it along. Gifgaf user Mark Tiddy has already put a video on about this charity, and so I thought I'd do a follow-up video and um, show you how stressful it can be, or how easy it's going to be, to live on five pound for five days. First things first, I think I better take you shopping. Let's see what we can actually buy for five pounds. Hmm, I'm thinking I may have gone over budget here by about 30 quid. Okay, I have been to Asda and I'm going to show you now what I have bought and this <laughs> this all comes to five pounds and one pence. Got instant mash nut, chopped tomatoes, spaggy bowl, lots of potatoes, uh, rice pudding, and like a little rice pudding, bread at the back there, two full size loaves of bread, uh, 45p and 47p loaf of bread, uh, rice pudding, baked beans, spaggy, spaggy uh, spaghetti even, <laughs> um, yeah some more potatoes, jam, rice pudding, We've also got some instant soup. A few sachets of them in there as well. Just to add a bit of flavour to it. So that's what we've also got. I've also incorporated three two litre bottles of water. Today is day one of me, you know. Oh, look at them crisps. No, I can't touch the crisps. Pot noodle at the back there. Can't even touch pot noodle. <laughs> but I want the pot noodle. Okay, I'll just have to settle with this. Mm. Here's my food. Okay, as you can see, I've got potatoes on there. Mm, nice. I've um, got coleslaw on there. I've got spaghetti bowl, beans, um, yeah, and uh, three rounds of toast. No butter, no tomato sauce, because it's saucy enough as it is. And that is going to be my dinner. It's now 5.56 in the evening. I've eaten nothing all day, so I'm really looking forward to this. Mini Flax is having Chinese char siu pork. Yeah, and you compare that to that, yeah, okay. Here we are on Tuesday's main meal. Time is now 5.57 p.m. And I'm now having, oh yes, instant mashed potato. I've used about half of instant mashed potato. I'm making a bit of a um, concoction here and I am so hungry. I think it's starting to sort of take effect that I've not eaten meat now for a couple of days because I'm a meat eater. I love my meat, but okay. So we've got that on the go. We've got that on the go, okay. And in the Philips Actra fry, you can see there, let's put another couple in. There we go, we've got some potatoes roasting away in there. Half a tin of, well, potatoes. And here we have our delicious finished product. Hello, it's Thursday. Yep, somehow I managed to miss Wednesday. Um, I spent most of it in bed. Bad cold and stuff and, oh. Man flu. Oh, been suffering real bad. <laughs> Just about to do myself some potatoes again, some beans again, some um, spaghetti bolognese again, some toast again. I need variety. But I should go get myself some food and see if I feel a little bit better. Time now is 2.40. <coughs> Excuse me. Here we are with the main meal of Thursday. And as you can see on my plate now, I should have gone for a bit more variety um, than what I did buy. But I've got toast, spaggy bowl, normal spaghetti, tomatoes, beans. I've even had to go for jam. That's, I've got jam there and at the back there as well. I've also got rice pudding. Here we are at supper time. Time now 8.47 on Thursday. And I'm now going to eat this. My taste buds are completely shot now, so it don't really matter what I what I eat. I've got jam sandwiches on white bread, jam sandwiches on brown bread, and beans. Yep, it's a bit of a concoction. It's a bit of a mixture. But with this cold, my taste buds are just screaming out for any sort of flavour. So I'm going to have that. I've still got a bit of coleslaw left as well. I might have a bit of coleslaw on there. Ugh, nah, that would just wrong, wouldn't it? That would just be sick. 
It's Friday, people, and the last day of this lift for a pound a day maximum malarkey. And, yeah, I'm still feeling pretty bugged up with cold and stuff. Which means I've not been eating that much. So, what have we got left then? Well, I've still got that. There's a few tins over there. I've still got pretty much a full loaf of bread as well. So, um, another tin of spaghetti. And I'm about to do myself some um, spaghetti and stuff on toast. Another concoction of mess. I know for next time, though. Next time I'm definitely going to try and get more variety. Especially now I realise how much I've got left. You know, that's going to got last me the rest of the day. And I've got four sausage rolls in there at the moment, in the fridge. Four sausage rolls and some tomato sauce. And I'm so looking forward to that. One minute past midnight, I'm going to be going and sitting in the fridge and helping myself to that. Oh, I can't wait. If you did this challenge, then let me know in the comments below the things we do for charity. Marvellous. Thank <laughs> you.